Hi, my name is Latish Sahgal and this is going to be a short video on LinkPad. LinkPad is a general purpose code scratch pad and it also lets you fire link queries against different data sources without using Visual Studio. It is also a code snippet execution engine and it's very keyboard friendly. Um, you can get both free and paid versions of LinkPad and you get some more features in the paid version and I highly recommend going for the paid version. Once I fire up LinkPad and click on add connection, I have the choice to add a link to SQL connection or a WCF connection. So if I select link to SQL, then I can choose either a local SQL Server instance to connect to or a compact version of SQL Server or even SQL Azure. Uh, you'll also see on the lower left hand side that I can use SSL for my connection if I want to. Once I've connected to any database, I can right click on a table and fire a link query against that table. You get the results in the lower half of the application and if you want you can export the results to either word or excel if you go to the lambda tab then you can see the lambda expression corresponding to the link query that we wrote similarly in if you go to the sql tab you can see the sql query that was generated for this link expression you can also open the SQL query in SQL Server Management Studio directly from within LinkPad. And the last tab will show you the IL code for this link expression. If you choose to explore the results in Grid, you can actually edit the data here. So I can click on Edit Data and change something for example this first name here and if I click on save the changes should be persisted if I want to hide the extension methods that are being shown while in IntelliSense I just have to press ctrl H and then that reduce and that eliminates all those extension methods if I'm using IntelliSense and I press tab on a method then I get a default template for the lambda expression if you look on the left hand side, we can see blue and green links that correspond to association properties. The green links correspond to one to many properties, whereas the blue links correspond to one to one or many to one properties. If you want to work with the same query but change only some of the details, we can clone a query and that will open a copy of the same query in a new tab. We can also execute stored procedures from within LinkPad. Similarly, we can execute functions from within LinkPad. We can also connect to a WCF data service from within LinkPad. So in this case, I'm connecting to the Stack Exchange O data service. And we can test the connection. And I can execute link queries against this service, just like we were doing against the database. If we go to the request log tab, we can see the URL for the exact request that was made. You can also download more drivers to connect to other data sources such as MySQL, SQLite, Oracle databases, and a bunch of other data sources.